Hey, what's up guys? This is the Game Hunter, another episode of Star Wars Commander Empire. And today, let's go back to the Tiny account. Let's see what is happening. And also, I believe there is another event. I think it's the 501 Battalion for Vader or something. I have no idea. Well, let's, let's check this out. Okay, currently, remember, I'm headquarter level 5, so things are getting super, super quiet. The reason I'm not showing you the other account is because I'm doing plenty of upgrades, and they taking me... The upgrades are taking me around a week to pretty much two weeks, which is crazy. I'm trying to upgrade the the academy and also upgrading the how does it call it? Let me let me remember. Let me remember. Let me remember. If I see the building, that's what happens when you don't play that often. Ah, uh, no, it's not here. It's not here. It's not here. It's not here. It's not. What, what is it? Hmm. Where are? Uh, what is the building where when we need to upgrade the troops? Well, it's definitely not here. Oh, right there. The research lab. And doing the upgrade so I can start getting some prestige units. But in the meantime, well, let, let's see what's happening in here. Like I say, one of the problems that I was having in the with the other account, with the main account, is that most of my opponents, they're, I believe they're bots account. Accounts are being created by the developers so we can gather resources to do the upgrade. Because, you know, that's one of the... One of the issues that we always had with the uh, with the game, the lack of ec the, the economy really getting out of control at one point. Um, for example, when I was getting close to uh, headquarter level 10, just thinking in getting 5 million credits or 5 million in alloy to upgrade building, it was just nuts. It was just ridiculous. So I believe they decided to add a couple of these ghost accounts or bots accounts to be able to get those resources. But the problem is that now I'm only coming across bots accounts. So it's it's not really fun. It's really not fun. So we're gonna we're gonna go back to the other account in a few just to see all the new upgrades and everything. But let's see what we can do in this one, right? This is one more time headquarter level five. I don't even remember what kind of troops I have. The transport is full. Do I need to start upgrading something else? I think I have plenty of buildings that I need to upgrade. Uh, level five. No, I cannot upgrade this one because it's gonna ask me for headquarter level six. Okay, so there is maybe a couple of these turrets that we can. Upgrade. This is level 5-2. Level 5. We only have two shield generators. Level 5-2. That's great. Um, until now, it's it's okay to have mortars because there's a lot of infantry. Heavy infantry are attacking me. Uh, but once that we reach uh, my other account level, for example, headquarter level 10, I believe I'm going to get rid of all the mortars. Some of you guys were posting posts, uh, actually posting information about that. And I think it's a good idea to just get rid of... Uh, the mortars and also just keep maybe just keep sonic cannons and rapid fire turrets we're more effective and um, most of the big attacks for uh, uh, rebel players at that level are using those jumpy troopers uh, the ones with the jetpack and the mortars are just completely useless against those guys so all right so let's get into this i believe i have one of the i think it's vader the sample unit that we're receiving this one but what we're gonna do we might need to we're gonna probably try the Imperial Starfighter. Is this a hero, right? No, this is not a hero. It's a looter. Imperial pilots are capable fighters, even in the ground, applying their rigorous academy training to tasks of destroying enemy resources, generator, and storage. Thanks to their fleet connections, uh, this unit is called TIE Fighters. What? Really? Wow, okay, that's... I don't remember ever using these guys, so this is a perfect episode for this. But let's first of all get rid of the troops. What we have... And after that, let's figure out if we can get... Ah, oh, yeah, the, the price is trying to agree, uh, trying to get Vader. Mm. Or maybe some, at least some, some sample, right? So let's get ready. Let's go for a first attack with this Empire account, level 5. Five minutes after, and finally I got a base with some loot. It's not even close to what I was getting with the, with the other account, but you know what? At least it's something. It, it was just ridiculous. I wasn't getting anything, anything at all. It was so difficult. So... All right, so we're going to start from the middle because I see there is three shield generators and this one is in an easy location. I'm trying to get familiar one more time with the troops that I have available, which are dark troopers and also those stormies. Also got those... I uh, uh, got a tank. I'm going to be very, very careful. These guys are not that powerful either. So I need to take it slow if we're going to make an opening. I don't want to deploy yet the dark troopers because they're going to get too crazy. I'm going against that tu uh, tourists that are in the right side. I just I'd rather wait until we can get... Okay. We can get close to the 
the next shield generator, the one on the right side, before deploying the rest. Okay, so now we are getting close to get rid of it, the last shield generator that is coming from the right side. Yeah, I need more Stormies to provide some extra support. So now, finally, our hero is available to start targeting um, buildings, not only shield generators. So far, so good. 34%. Let's see if we can deploy something else. I'm gonna deploy probably a couple of drug troopers from here. And after that, we're gonna deploy our tank. I'm receiving a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage, fellas. Yeah, apparently we are just... I forgot that my hero is a really low level guy. So let's see if we can get at least two stars. One star is gonna be for sure. But I'm not really sure if my hero is going to turn to the left and finally destroy that. I want to deploy the troops because, like I say, the, the economy has been so, so, so bad that spending that many credits uh, trying to bring down a base is, is probably not worth it. Actually, we got only one star. Wow. I got half of the resources. Well, that's not good. <laughs> that's what happens when you start playing with an account that you haven't touched in so long and you have no idea the level of the troops and what you have. So, well, let's get ready. Uh, let's go for the next attack. This one has some really good alloy, so let's see what we can do. I'm gonna use this new hero that I haven't used before. I believe it's called the Dark Troopers. No, I believe it's called Dark Troopers. Well, let, let's start the attack first and then we can uh, figure out what to do. There's cannons over there. There is some rocket turret here. I believe we can start from there. You should be able to stay out of range of any turrets. No, then no, then no. I don't think so. And after that, we're going to deploy our AT. AT. Okay. Where's our hero? I believe this is the hero, right? Yes. Let's go with this guy. Oh, oh okay. This guy is going to start targeting turrets. That's pretty cool. I haven't seen that guy yet in action until now, so let's see what they're doing. So we're gonna deploy this this the guy, the looter, that we're supposed to check in this episode. I don't know if it's a good idea. My ATAT is making some crazy moves. Uh, the good thing is that the that hero is destroying turret extremely, extremely fast. And the looter is doing a really good job also taking care of the resources building. And it's pretty tough. Let's see. See the guy's right there. Receiving some damage. That's okay. It's calling some TIE Fighters too. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure you guys saw that. I wasn't paying attention, but I just noticed. <laughs> that he was shooting also some uh, TIE Fighters. So that's great. And uh, we should be able to, with 42 more seconds to go, we should be able to get all the alloy. Let's see. We're going to deploy a couple extra Stone Trooper from here. Let's see if we can get the three stars. Because the first attack was really crappy. We only got one. Our at is in a difficult spot. It's going to start receiving damage from that turret. That's great. Uh, there's another rocket turret in the middle. But the at, -AT should be able to bring that down. Maybe it's a good idea if you attack the turret before attacking that barracks. But that's okay. That's okay. I mean, the most important thing is that we can get all the loot. And apparently we got it. Absolutely awesome. We're going to get like a 90% damage. That's all I care. Almost three stars. We got all the loot. We, we got 90%. Ahí está. There you go. <laughs> Ahí está. I just say it in Spanish. There you go. We got 90%. We got all the alloy that we need. And now we can start upgrading another turret. Interesting, that looter. Huh? And also that hero that I wasn't thinking of using it. Let's double check in there. It's called the Death Trooper. The Death Trooper, that was really good. The squad of three elite stormtroopers. The troopers serve mainly as bodyguards for important Imperial officers, but it's almost better for the special line commander missions. The troopers will target enemy defensive installations, including turrets and traps. Pretty good. I, I think we can probably do another episode dedicated to the Death Trooper so we can try in different combinations. But uh, so far, so good. And this is the current status of this base. We're going to start upgrading maybe uh, another... Is there any rocket turret in here that we need to upgrade? No, yet. Maybe you. You're getting ready. You are getting ready. There you go. We got another building upgrading. And this is going to take me a couple of days. And after that, we're going to start doing some 
good attacks, maybe um, maybe a long session of uh, farming, so we can gather as many resources as possible and get, start getting ready to move to headquarter level 6. Fellas, this is the Game Hunter. We don't know what episode Star Wars Commander. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share my videos. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody. Bye.